In good health this morning, we all know that feeling. You wake up in the morning, you're feeling irritable, maybe a little groggy with no explanation. But could what you're eating before bed affect the quality of your sleep? For some, when the clock strikes midnight, it's a time to count sheep. But for others, their stomach tells them otherwise. I am a snacker, so I'll get up in the middle of the night and I'll eat ice cream or I'll, I'll eat chocolate or something, and I'll just go back to bed. For Dan Henry, the connection is becoming more clear. Once I fell asleep, I'd have trouble staying asleep, and I would notice that I would have unusually vivid dreams once I finally got to sleep. Is the late night bite to blame? Dr. Glenn Adams, medical director of Sarasota Memorial Hospital Sleep Disorder Clinic, says yes and no. If you eat foods that are sugary sweet drinks or desserts and stuff like that, uh, those tend to decrease the production of serotonin. A mood relaxing hormone essential for a good night's sleep. If you have caffeine, piece of chocolate, chocolate ice cream, something like that, uh, and the caffeine is upsetting your sleep, then you may not be sleeping quite as well. You're going to be more likely to remember your dreams. Typically, the dreams we remember are the dreams we wake up from. Now, instead of the sweet stuff, you should opt for foods that are high in melatonin, like berries, maybe a little chicken, some milk, or cottage cheese. There are other <laughs> things as well. I know, completely <laughs> random. And who has, like, chicken just cooked, ready to eat <laughs> right. in the middle of the night? Uh, Dr. Adams says that it's best to talk to your doctor about healthy options. But you have some pretty uh, wild dreams, if you know what I mean. <laughs> what are you eating before bed? I don't know. Well, the dream you're talking about was random. But typically, <laughs> I don't remember my dreams, and I don't remember what I ate the night before that, so who knows. But